Over the last few years, the Atlantic Basin was impacted by extremely active hurricane seasons with many record stats, exhausting the names list two years in a row with a total of 19 landfalling storms in the U.S. 2020 holds the record for most billion dollar hurricane disasters in a season, and 26 out of the 30 named storms that year still hold the record for earliest to form for their respective letter. This year, NOAA and Colorado State University both forecast an above average season. So where are all of the storms? As it turns out, this isn't far off from a typical start to the season. When you look at activity over a longer period, say 170 years, what's normal is for the U.S. to get a pre-August hurricane about once every four years or so. In June and July this year, we've had three named storms, Alex, Bonnie, and Colin. Climatology averages the third storm by August 3rd, so we're pretty much right on track. Across the Atlantic, we've had a lot of Saharan dust so far this summer. Dust coming off of northern Africa that dries out tropical systems. But once we get into the month of August, we'll start to see tropical cyclones a little bit more likely, and they're more likely to have impacts to the United States coast. So in the coming weeks, keep it here on Weather Nation, and we'll continue to bring you the latest tropical forecast. For Weather Nation, I'm meteorologist Kit Kloniger.